Good evening, everyone. Thank you for clicking on the Evening Weather Webcast. I'm meteorologist Thomas Keyboy. Hope every single one of you had a wonderful weekend. Sunday was a little bit of a gloomy day with some heavy rain showers and even a couple severe thunderstorm warnings issued. Ha good news is, though, not going to have to deal with that anytime into the near future. But what it did do was make things just a little bit cooler today. When we started off this morning, temperatures were at 60 degrees. That was the overnight low from last night. And today we only warmed up to about 63 degrees and temperatures still falling. By the time we get to tomorrow morning, we should be into the mid and low 50s. The main reason it's been like that has been the cloud cover that's been around most of the day. We're starting to see a few breaks. However, once we go through the next few hours, still thinking that the cloud cover is still going to hang around. But the good news is we're going to keep the rain chances away. So you can see by tomorrow morning, the clouds are going to start building back in. Maybe a few areas of some patchy, dense fog, but overall not going to be very widespread. So through the afternoon, early morning hours and afternoon, we're going to see more clouds build in. And that's probably going to keep temperatures a little bit cooler than what they can be get tomorrow. But overall, we're going to keep the rain chances away with mostly cloudy skies with a few peaks of sun here and there. And here's a look at the future temperatures by tonight. Temperatures tomorrow morning when you wake up should be into the low 50s, thinking 53 degrees here in Dothan. And then by tomorrow afternoon, based upon the cloud cover, we'll determine how warm we get. Thinking temperatures are going to get pretty close to 70 degrees, but more clouds means we'll be a little bit cooler. So 68 definitely possible. And then also if we get more sun, 70s, low 70s is, is a probability as well. But as we go through further in time, things are going to begin to change a little bit. Our next system is going to be safe, shaping up. So we're not going to have any rain chances for at least the next couple days. But as we go into Thursday, we're going to be watching our next cold front move closer to us, possibly bringing us big changes and potentially old man winter making a comeback for but for more details, make sure you tune into WTBY News 4, News at 10 with meteorologist Nate Harrington. Or tune in tomorrow for WRJX First News at 4 and 5.30 for your full extended forecast. If you have any questions, leave it at the social media sites below. But if not, we will see you back here on Tuesday. Have a great day, everybody.